Welcome to English Practice Every Day. Idioms we will learn today are 1. Lift the well, lift the well. 2. Into minds, into minds. 3. Big cheese, big cheese. 4. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. 5. Give and take, give and take. 6. Pitch in, pitch in. 7. Sucks to be you, sucks to be you. Let's start. Please speak out loud with me. 1. Lift the well. Lift the well. Lift the well means to reveal or uncover something hidden or secret. Lift the well means to reveal or uncover something hidden or secret. The documentary aimed to lift the well on the realities of living in poverty. The documentary aimed to lift the well on the realities of living in poverty. The journalist's investigation lifted the veil on corruption within the government. The journalist's investigation lifted the veil on corruption within the government. The whistleblower's revelations lifted the veil on the company's unethical practices. The whistleblower's revelations lifted the well on the company's unethical practices. Two, in two minds, in two minds. In two minds means unsure or undecided about something or to be torn between two choices or opinions. In two minds means unsure or undecided about something or to be torn between two choices or opinions. I am in two minds about whether to accept the job offer or not. I am in two minds about whether to accept the job offer or not. Sophie is in two minds about which university to attend next year. Sophie is in two minds about which university to attend next year. We are in two minds about whether to go out for dinner or stay in and cook. We are in two minds about whether to go out for dinner or stay in and cook. Three. Big cheese. Big cheese. Big cheese means an important or influential person or someone who holds a position of authority or power. Big cheese means an important or influential person or someone who holds a position of authority or power. As the head chef, Pierre is the big cheese in the kitchen. As the head chef, Pierre is the big cheese in the kitchen. In Hollywood, the big cheese is often the producer who can greenlight projects. In Hollywood, the big cheese is often the producer who can greenlight projects. Tom thinks he is the big cheese just because he is the captain of the football team. Tom thinks he is the big cheese just because he is the captain of the football team. Four. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree means children often resemble their parents in behavior or personality. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree means children often resemble their parents in behavior or personality. Amy has her mother's talent for painting. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Amy has her mother's talent for painting. The apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Jean inherited his father's sense of humor. Truly, the apple doesn't fall far from the tree.
Jean inherited his father's sense of humor. Truly, the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. The Smiths are all doctors. It seems the apple doesn't fall far from the tree in that family. The Smiths are all doctors. It seems the apple doesn't fall far from the tree in that family. Five, give and take. Give and take. Give and take means the principle of compromise or mutual concession in a relationship or negotiation. Give and take means the principle of compromise or mutual concession in a relationship or negotiation. A successful marriage requires a lot of give and take from both partners. A successful marriage requires a lot of give and take from both partners. Parenting involves a lot of give and take, balancing discipline with understanding. Parenting involves a lot of give and take, balancing discipline with understanding. In any negotiation, there has to be some give and take for both parties to reach an agreement. In any negotiation, there has to be some give and take for both parties to reach an agreement. Six, pitch in, pitch in. Pitch in means to contribute or help with a task, project or effort. Pitch in means to contribute or help with a task, project or effort. I'll cook dinner if you pitch in and set the table. I'll cook dinner if you pitch in and set the table. Everyone needs to pitch in and clean up the mess after the party. Everyone needs to pitch in and clean up the mess after the party. It's a community garden, so everyone is expected to pitch in and help maintain it. It's a community garden, so everyone is expected to pitch in and help maintain it. Seven, sucks to be you. Sucks to be you. Sucks to be you is used to express indifference or lack of sympathy for someone's misfortune. Sucks to be you is used to express indifference or lack of sympathy for someone's misfortune. You missed the last train home again? Well, sucks to be you. You missed the last train home again? Well, sucks to be you. When Kate complained about her long work hours, her colleague simply replied, Sucks to be you. When Kate complained about her long work hours, her colleague simply replied, Sucks to be you. After hearing about Joe's car breaking down, Jerry shrugged and said, Well, sucks to be you, I guess. After hearing about Joe's car breaking down, Jerry shrugged and said, Well, sucks to be you, I guess. That's all for this idiom practice session. Please keep practicing the idioms we learned today until the next time when we pick up seven more idioms and master them. Bye for now.